I need a 30 for 30 to show that I'm different like Jordan and Pimmin, you bitch. I need a 30 for 30 like Jalen and Webber. Nobody gon' fuck with my clip. I need a 30 for 30. Man, uh, I'm sure y'all watch the game Saints versus 49ers. Uh, y'all came out on the you know, short end of the stick. It was a good game, though. Good game. Good game. But Saints fans, they might be looking at it like they really came out on the short end of the stick. Because it turns out that their Hall of Fame, future Hall of Fame quarterback, Drew Brees, is hurt. Now, we don't really know how long he's going to be out, but he's definitely going to be out. Because this is coming from Edward Water, y'all know over uh, ESPN. He reports that Breeze is suffering from three fractured ribs on his left side and two of them motherfuckers on the right side. And that the man had damage to his lung. I think some folks saying like a, a, a collapsed lung, didn't it? Something like that? Yeah. yeah, something yeah. Like that. Uh, uh, crazy shit, or man. Uh, or something. And they actually say that, that, that one of the damn injuries didn't even happen in the game against y'all. That had happened the previous week, and that that didn't show up on the initial X-rays. That didn't show up and because he's dealing with a shoulder injury, too, so he didn't really feel the pain from that. It's like a lot of crazy shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and then Drew posted a picture with him and his kids and talking about Saints fans, I'm going to be all right. I got the best me medical staff in the game. But one of them kids sound like to me need to be telling his dad, dad to stay your ass at the house. Because, God damn, bro, all them ribs fucked up, collapsed lung. That shit sound like retirement, go ahead and gold jacket me, please. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure Saints fans don't want to hear that shit. So uh, I want to know from you guys, do y'all think that his in injury, if he misses any kind of time, I know the Saints did sweep the books, but it's still, you know, saying a race in the NFC South. So do you think that his injury kind of opens the door for Tom Brady and the Bucks to come on through and take the South. Joe, we'll start with you. Man, who knew a win could hurt so bad? Right. Uh, Bruh, for one, as, as you stated, Breeze came into that game injured. As far as them saying that they didn't know, I, I don't buy that. He just tried, he tried to good it out. And, oh, by the way, that was not, that should not have been flagged for um roughing the passer. Speak on that, it. That, that should not. The man he he fell to the side. And I like let's just be real. This year, I think Breeze then got hit a lot this year. Um, so it just it it took its toll. And now the thing is, everybody thinks, hey, Breeze out, they finna insert Winston. I don't know. Because they pay and take some heel like a lot of money. And we know you, you're not just going to be paying somebody. I don't think they would pay him that much money to be the Swiss Army knife. Because, um, like, literally, I I don't I don't want to call out the man contract because I don't want him, you know, speak less than what he getting. But it's like true backup QB money. So I really don't know. And he's saying he's not going to name a QB um, up until game time or whatever. So no one knows. But let's assume that it's Winston mm -hmm. because we know Winston has played the QB position. Well, we all know what Winston did last year. 79, um, he had 380 completions, 626 attempts. That's 60%. Um, 5,109 yards. I mean, that's good. 33 touchdowns. I can live with that. 30 <laughs> INTs. Uh, brother, what you doing? He had the surgery, Joe. Joe he but, had the surgery. Let, let, let me finish. Let okay, me finish. Okay, okay go now, ahead. Th those numbers <laughs> was before the LASIK surgery. I hope it worked. I hope he able to see the People that have the same jerseys as he has, that's who he's supposed to throw to. I hope he's able to see that. I want him to see that. Um, what I do know is Sean Payton is one of our better offensive play callers. Been in the league a while. I don't think he would put Jameis in harm's way. 
He gonna throw slants to Mike Thomas. You <laughs> gonna go get the uh, ball? You gonna get the ball? He gonna throw uh, intermediate routes right. probably to Sanders, things like that. I don't think he gonna have them, you know, throwing it like Bruce had him. Bruce had him throwing it all over the field. I, I don't think Sean gonna do that as far as deep. Now, let me say that. A whole bunch of deep pass. He won't do that. Um, and that, you got Kamara in the backfield. Do I think this opens the door for Brady? It does open the door. But you know, here, I'm put it on something. We have to make hard statements, right? That's right. That's what the fuck we do. The Saints still will win the NFC South. They will still win the South. I was looking at the schedule. Mm -hmm. uh, the Buccaneers got Rams, Chiefs, Vikings, Falcons, Lions, Falcons. I'm going to go out on a limb and say they will lose. They will lose. They will go 500 the rest of the way. They'll lose three of them. Who? The Buccaneers. They, they will lose three of them. So you put Again, them at, those, so you those put teams. Them at, you put them at 10 and 6 then. I'm putting them at 10 and 6. You remember yeah. I said 9 and 7. Yeah, you did say that. I did. Well, look, they, they won up. Okay. <laughs> Literally. Right. Uh, the Saints, they have Falcons, Broncos, Falcons, Eagles, Chiefs, Vikings. I actually think they will go 500 the rest of the way also, which will put them, if I'm not mistaken, they have the same record right now, right? I think they're 6 and three, 3. No, they got the Saints at 7 and 2. Seven and two. Okay. So they won't be tied. So the Saints will win the NFC South. So it do, it does open the door because I think the, with Breeze, the Saints would have ended up running away with it. Mm -hmm. But, of course, you're bringing in a new QB. How well will he, will he gel with um, Michael Thomas, Emmanuel Sanders, Kamara, and the fact that we don't know who the actual starting QB will be which I think that's on purpose, to keep it a mystery. But at some point, we're going to know, you know, uh, this this coming Sunday, we're going to know who's the starter until Breeze get back. Um, and and but, just so I can mention this, that, that, okay. that in, in that same report from work, or uh, uh, Ed Water, sound like they in, uh, they saw him saying like one week. Then if they put him on IR, he had to miss three weeks. Yeah, you have to miss three. But man, from the the shit I told y'all wrong with him, I'm gonna be honest. How you come? I, to I, I think the, I, I I think they're I think they're saying that hoping that teams won't be able to prepare for them. Um, but I think Breeze may be done for the year. He may come back playoff time, but he may be done for the year. Like you, you got to think when you're dealing with your lungs, you don't want to play with that. That, that, that ain't don't sound me. right. Collapse lung don't sound yeah, you, right. You don't play with it. No. And the fact that on the on the picture that we saw with his kids, you know that machine he was breathing in. I know about the breathing machine. I, know about I had one of those when I had seven and, hour spinal and that, surgery. And and I'm that. telling you, for the people that don't know, trying to breathe into those machines right after you done had surgery or you got injured, man, that hurts. Like it ain't easy. So, uh, well wishes to breathe, speedy recovery. Um, but I, I, I don't see him coming back until maybe, maybe at the end of the season, maybe the last two games, something like that. I say at best. Is that why you got him at 500 or you saying even if he comes back, they that's finish, why they finish out 500. That's why I got them at 500. Okay. That, that's why I got him. And so that would put them at what record? Well, it, well, well, they got seven more games left now because you said they were seven and two. They got seven. So, so they they got to be four, three, or three and four. So yeah. So let me not say that. Um, I said five hundred for the Saints. They'll beat the Broncos. They'll beat the Eagles. They'll beat the Vikings because they owe them anyway. One, two, three. Oh, now. At, at the least, they'll split with the Falcons. So I got them winning at least four. Okay. But at the end of the day, 
Brady, you're not coming over there running nothing. You finna see what second place in the division feel like. The Tom Brady folks finna be hey, on, on our ass again and te texting me and, and DMing and all kinds yes. of shit. Come with it. Come on the show with it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Joe. What'd you say, Joe? I'm just saying, come with it. Come on the show with it. We can send a link, can't we? We can. We can send a link. <laughs> Listen to me, because we're going to bring up all the stats that they try to avoid. Right. 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 T, what you think, man? You think that door open for uh, 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 Tom Brady and them Bucks down there? Oh, yeah, it's open. It's open. Um, Are they yeah. going to walk through that motherfucker? But these next two weeks going to tell the tale. Because the okay. Rams ain't going to be no easy one. And, and the Chiefs game, <laughs> that, that, that catch up boy in them. So we already know what that's going to be about. Now, the back half, you got the Vikings, you got the Falcons twice, you got the Lions. I mean... I mean, let's just call it what it is. They should win those last four games. They should. But I think what you I think um I think the door is open. But I do think that if it's one person I trust as a coach to manage this situation, it's Sean Payton. He's smart enough. He knows how to game plan. He knows how to keep Jameis out of trouble. If he's gonna start Jameis, I think he knows what to do with Taysom. If, if Taysom is a starter. But I don't think Taysom is going to be a starter. I think Taysom is going to stay in the role he's going to stay in. I think Jameis is going to start. I think you're going to see the same kind of packages you see from Taysom. But um, I think Sean is going to is gonna really turn around and hand it to AK-41 and say, hey, let's get it done. So I, I think the door is going to be open, but I think, this, I, think this, I think it's going to come down to if they tie – I mean, the Saints got the tiebreaker, right? Because they they beat. They swept them. Them. <laughs> so, so even if it comes down to two, both teams being ten and six, Saints still got the nod. So, I think it's just gonna be one of them ones that, of course, they're gonna keep it hyped up and they're gonna talk about well, Brady and them can win the division. But at the end of the day, though, Saints just got too much pride. So, I can see Breeze coming back around Christmas time, before Christmas, baby. Um. I think he's if he's smart, he would take his take about three weeks off. <clears throat> they got the Falcons twice and the Broncos the next three weeks. I think this is perfect time for Breeze to sit. I think Jameis could get some burn, maybe even sell himself as hey, I could be a starter again. And 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 then hand that thing to the most specialist running back in all the land. <laughs> that dog on Alvin Kamara. So it is what it is, man. I, I, but I don't think the door is. I think the door is open. But I don't, I don't think. I don't think Brady and them gonna walk through it though. When when Drew got hurt last year, was it was Teddy his backup? Teddy. Teddy, Teddy was went five. Teddy, Teddy went Teddy, five and zero. Oh. That's all I about to say. Teddy went undefeated, didn't he? Yeah. Okay. Who uh, uh who you say is a better quarterback, Teddy or uh, James Winston? Teddy. Off top. You know, I can't believe that was a question, but all right. Teddy. Teddy. Well, y'all, hold on, Joe. Hold on. Now. I'm just, I'm just, I'm going on. off the stats. No, look, I, man. I'm, I'm Nick Wright. But did Jameis, baby, he, he, he didn't, he didn't, he didn't done some things, some things in this league. Well, he threw 5,000 yards last year. Well, he, he won, he won a national championship at Free well, Shoes University. Anybody that put their <laughs> fingers in the form of a W <laughs> and lick it. <laughs> Can't put no trust in it. Yeah, I know I used to fuck with Free Shoes University, man. That's why I was, I was trying to trying to show Jameis a little bit of something, man. I know, and you brought up college. You do remember he stole crab legs, right? I know. That's why I just I mentioned it. I was thorough. Uh, you know, he also did some other dumb shit down there. Didn't, didn't he have like a, a case, sexual rap or some bad shit? Knowing him, what one put it past him. Yeah, Jameis motherfucker. All right, so but, so all right, this is why I asked in the first place. I was like, okay, T said something about uh Sean Payton is the well maybe that was you, Joe. One of y'all said y'all would trust Sean Payton managing this type of situation. Mm -hmm. And so that made me think about last year. Shit, we were in a it didn't sound as gruesome as this injury right now. But shit, he got hurt last year and it went undefeated. You know what I'm saying? 
And I remember that distinctly because I remember before he got hurt, everybody had Drew Brees in the MVP conversation. And then I was like, how the fuck you the MVP? You get hurt and your team go undefeated without your goddamn ass. All right. Because in Green Bay, when we lost Aaron Rodgers, my team looked like shit. <laughs> so, uh, Which is why Drew Brees came back a little early. Because how Teddy was playing. You know, you know, they say that's the thing with Tom Brady. He's not going to let you get a chance to look at the backup. Because everybody know if the backup can do what you're doing at a cheaper price, you're going out the door. Well, okay. Well, well do you think – I know it's Jameis. I know y'all saying Teddy better mm-hmm. than Jameis. Can Sean Payton then manage Jameis with this? Or, or Taysom? I, I, now, 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 Taysom may be putting that bitch on the ground a lot, I see. See, like every time I watch them boys, Taysom be about to truck a motherfucker, be also yeah. on the ground. He, he, he does. Thing. So I, I trust Peyton. I, I trust Sean Payton. If Jameis shows he's he can do what Teddy did, Breeze may only let one rib heal before he come back. Because I, I don't know why, but I, I got a feeling Brees want to play one more time. I think he want one more year. I think he want another bowl. If he okay, can get a, a bowl. He's not getting it. He's not getting it. God damn, Joe. Oh, my bad. You don't want these, you know, T. Why is going to be on your ass now? I, I know. That, but I'm just saying. I, I don't want people to get their hopes up. He, listen, they got their one. Oh, what was that? Oh, you heard on no hill? He ain't trying to keep his shit together. What you say, T? He ain't gonna, he ain't gonna get it, man. See there. He ain't gonna get it. Career number just put up stats at this point. I mean, okay, so stats and wins. So let's look at the last three years of the playoffs for them boys. <coughs> now you know, T, they're gonna bring up that they got cheated now with the Rams. No, they're gonna hit your hand with that now. Okay, but I mean my thing is you. You know, there's plenty of opportunities in that game where y'all could have manufactured points and got this. And that's true, because people don't talk about that. It did go in overtime. All right, then. And they did get a, they did have a possession that they didn't do anything with now. And they did let Diggs catch. I don't even know how that happened. From Minnesota. I don't know. All right, to, to y'all point, because his defense is outside of the top 10 giving up 23.7 points per game. All right? So it's like they they not trash. They're not trash defense. They're in the second tier of defense. 32 teams. Okay. You can break it down basically into thirds. You know what I'm saying? You got gotcha. the top 10 great defenses. The okay defense ain't trash defense. <laughs> so they middle of the way. Middle mm-hmm. of the way. So kind of middle of the way defense with a Hall of Fame quarterback. Get it done. If this man lungs don't give out, I, I think Saints fan would would argue with y'all about that. I'm not saying okay. You, you, you saying can they 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 can only because the other top tens in the NFC, mm-hmm. their defense is not really that good either. You had to bring that up. Um, see, no, not just not just the Pack Seattle, their defense is not good. Arizona, I don't think their defense is good. All right, so I I feel you there, Joe. With with Seattle defense trash, my defense middle of the road. Uh, look, uh, Arizona defense, they 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 top ten rated, but they they giving up twenty some odd points a game. And hold on, let me be, be thorough, goddamn it. Twenty three point three. They number nine in scoring defense. You know, what I'm saying? Okay. slide. You know, Tono. Now Tampa Bay though sitting up there. Giving up twenty two point six game. I know y'all say y'all see some some flaws, some cracks. Think think some of y'all said that. Yeah. That's secondary. So we'll see, man. It's gonna be interesting though, man, because that, that that injury. Just reading it, it looked like hey, this shit done. Out for the year. That's what I was thinking, but we'll see. I think he wants another bowl to be quite honest, just really solidify his place. That's what I think. Because he does not have an MVP. He got all them stats, but he ain't got no MVP. He does have that one bowl, but it just seemed like folks just don't 
they don't talk about him with Tom. I think he want to be. I want. I think he want folks to really put him there with Tom. Yeah, he, he, he's not going to get there, though. He just don't have enough. The only bowl he could look forward to is the soup that's going to be in the bowl for him right now. That's, that's the only bowl. Breeze, if, if you do decide to come back and play another year, just pad your stats, man. Just pad your stats. Rose Bowl. All, all right. Peach Bowl. Let me get this damn bowl. Hush. <laughs> What's the bowl that you and Selma always play in? Oh, All right. That, 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 <laughs> Go. Go. Subscribe to our daddy's YouTube channel. He's the best. Hit the like button. Turn on the notifications.